ourselves like, that's how local local brings the message across so you know these young people have been working hard uh, and, and and you know get ready for this show get ready to share with the world you share the story the tragic story right of what the, the murder that we all know what happened with Alex but also you know having the youth share their stories too Stephanie specifically has been since day one when we started this project and we said, you know what? We need to tell this story and we need to tell it from the perspective of people that are in it and living in it and in a way to heal. For me, what's really essential about this play is that how I feel a connection with the Yankos because they feel like a part of my family. The process has been, has been them writing you know, they're coming from personal places, they're doing a lot of interviews, people that have been involved, families, and uh, it's been, you know, close to your project. Ivan Lopez. I grew up here in the Mission District. Um, I grew up making art here, both in the Mission Cultural Center, in the streets. And I always was passionate about painting, drawing, still screening, photography. Uh, I ended up going to college in New York for five years to study industrial design, uh, where I kind of branched out more into like fashion design and painting. And so artillery is kind of like a culmination of all those designers that I was like meeting on the street and myself and my business partner Alexa Trevino who also does photography um, and we we wanted to create a venue that that embodied you know the cultural arts that are that's happening in San Francisco also because a lot we want to preserve it we wanted to keep going we wanted to like maintain that momentum which is something that's like difficult um, as like cities transition it's hard to like preserve the creative people in those spaces and so that's why we designed artillery yeah. <laughs> We have had folks that say that, you know, Latinos don't vote, and we are here to say, you know what, no, that's not true. Mi gente vota. Through the arts, we also feel that we can create a platform uh, to change behaviors, to start planting seeds that, you know, create alternative um, opportunities and um, that have visual narratives that have our faces and our needs reflected in art. And we Hi. My name is Vicky Castro and I'm the executive director of La Raza Centro Legal. We're here today in a partnership with Galeria de la Raza to promote the vote with Mi Gente Vota. It's been 51 years since the Voter Registration Act has been passed and it's been 41 years since the extension of that act has passed. And why that's critically important for our Latino community is because it allowed a lot of the registration material to be translated in different languages. What's up, mi gente? 
¿Cómo están todos? Hoy día estamos promocionando el voto. Lo que es importante del voto es que es, es nuestra voz en la comunidad.